Kitchen safety, a guide for students. Cartoon picture of knife, fry pan and saucepan. Hello, I'm Jackie and today I'm in the kitchen. Picture of woman standing in kitchen. So do you like seeing foods go from this? Picture of group of ingredients. To that. Picture of cheese and macaroni dish. I hope you do. And whether you're in the kitchen to cook up dinner or make a sandwich or get your breakfast ready, there are a few things that we need to think about to keep us safe. And we're gonna have a look at them now. Remember, when you're in the kitchen, tie your hair back, roll your sleeves up and wear an apron. Woman ties hair in ponytail, rolls up sleeves and puts on apron. Woman sprays cleaner and wipes over empty kitchen bench and stovetop. Always make sure you have a clean, clear kitchen bench or stovetop before you start preparing food. Woman at kitchen sink washes hands with soap and water. It is really important to always wash your hands well with soap and water before you start to touch food. Always turn the handles of pots and pans away from the edge of the stove. Woman turns handles of pot and pan on the stove top so that the handles are to the sides of the stove. Pots and pans get very hot, so only ever touch them by the handle. Woman wears oven glove to take lid off saucepan on stove and then carries saucepan using the handle. Protect your hands by wearing oven gloves when you need to open the oven or touch hot things from the oven, stove or microwave. Woman turns oven off and puts on oven gloves to take hot things out of the oven. Woman turns oven off, puts on oven gloves, then opens door and turns head away from the hot air from oven. Turn the oven off and stand back from the oven door before opening it. Woman empties can of baked beans into microwave container. Always use a microwave safe container in a microwave. Woman places the container of beans into the microwave oven. Woman wears gloves and opens microwave and takes container out of microwave. Woman empties container of warmed baked beans onto toast. There are sharp objects in the kitchen, so always be aware of what they are and always be careful when using them. Woman shows sharp objects such as knife, vegetable peeler and grater. Always hold sharp things by their handle. Woman picks up large knife by the handle and points to handle. And use them carefully. Woman use large knife to cut celery. Woman uses a vegetable peeler to peel carrot. Always carry a knife by the handle and point the blade to the floor. Woman takes knife out of knife block and carries knife by the handle with the blade pointing to the floor. Always turn the oven and stove off when you have finished. Woman turns off oven and then turns off stovetop. When you have used an appliance and have finished, turn it off at the power point and pull the cord out. Woman turns slow cooker off at the power point and takes cord out of the power point.
Always clean any spills on the floor or bench immediately. Woman bends down on floor and uses paper towel to clean up a spill from the floor. Woman wearing apron standing in kitchen. It's important to know how to be safe in a kitchen and prepare meals for yourself. So I hope this video has helped you with some kitchen safety things to think about. But remember though, if you're not sure about how to use something or what to do, or you just need help being safe, always ask someone. Can you help me please? In speech bubble near woman. So enjoy being in the kitchen and stay safe. New South Wales government logo on screen.